It's time for the first Unity devlog. In the last devlog, we did nothing because it doesn't exist. And in this devlog, we're going to be implementing a movement system. So the first thing I did was create a new project. And we have a bunch of crap in our project. Well, let's just delete all of that. Much better. The next thing I did was model this room. I know it looks bad, but that's okay because it's plain old. It obviously worked perfectly with the physics system. After fixing that, I added this basic light to light up the room. It's okay that it looks bad because it's plain old. Then I put the horrible lights all over the room and it still looked pretty bad. But that's okay because it's plain old. And I decided I didn't want to have in a closed room and instead designed this, which definitely looks a lot better. It also has physics, which makes it 10 times better. Now it's time to create our player. Uh, then I looked up a video on how to make a rigid body controller because I didn't do it right last time. I also decided that I wanted to use Unity's new input system, but I've never used it before. So after watching the video, I came up with this. After fixing that, we can move around without falling over, but we can't look around, so we kind of just walk like this. Next, I made it possible, sorry, tried to make it possible to look around. Here's what the mouse look system looks like. Then I added jumping, which surprisingly didn't have any bugs. And then I added sprinting, which also surprisingly didn't have any bugs. Oh, it's already Saturday. I guess unfortunately that's all I time for for this devlog. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one.